drops back. He looks down the field for an open receiver. He sees Hines Ward wide open. Throws the ball, and Ward catches it in the back of the end zone for a steal. Touchdown! Oh! Hey, Bobby! Hey, hey, you're just back it up. the best team in the NFL. So Speaking of your team. Hey, so rank it up. Sit down. <laughs> okay, both of these teams are good. You guys really want to find out who's the best? Yeah. Yeah. Alright, let's compare some stuff. Alright. <laughs> Alright, well, I'd like to start my argument off, Josh and Robert, by saying that Steelers are by far the best team. I mean, absolutely. And reasons being are, first off, their ownership. They're family owned. They were purchased by the Rooney family in 1933. They've been owned by the Rooney family ever since then, which is the longest family owned franchise in the NFL. And I think an example of how good of owners they are, they've only had three coaches since 1969, and Chuck Knoll, Bill Cower, and most recently, Mike Tomlin. Okay, now Robert, what do you have to say about that? Well, you're wrong. <laughs> the Bears are the best team in the NFL, period. They were founded in 1920 uh, by George Hallis and just Dutch Sternum uh, in conjunction with the A.E. Stanley Starch Food Company. Uh, they, Halas owned the team for over 60 years, and for several of them, he was a coach himself. He was very involved with the team. When he died, he passed the team on to other worthy owners. Uh, the the Mosquito and the Caskey. Okay, so let me get this right. You're saying they're the best because they've got a family owned team. That's You're right. saying they're better because they've got a team founded in the 20s by a food company. Well, Robert, you bring up a good point. So let's move on to the yeah. Steelers' legacy. What else do you guys have? The Steelers are the oldest team in the AFC. They have six Super Bowl titles and seven AFC championships, which the next closest are the 49ers and the Dallas Cowboys, which each have five. I don't see the Bears anywhere close, but, you know, that's just me. Their overall record is 534 and 497 losses. And 20 ties. Their playoff record is 31 and 19, which is pretty much unheard of. So what do you say? Well, the Bears are the second oldest team in the NFL, older than the Steelers. Uh, they're, they're 1920. Uh, they have nine overall championships since then, but since the Super Bowl wasn't started till '66, uh, only one of them was after the Super Bowl. Uh, they do have over 700 total wins. It's more than 100 more than the Steelers. And they also have a winning record. I gotta say, those wins, they kind of go against you guys. Yeah, he's, they've been around longer, that's true. All right, what else do you guys got? Let's look at Steelers' history of excellence since they entered the league. They became a dynasty during the 70s, led by Terry Bradshaw. They won four different Super Bowl titles during the 70s, including two different back-to-back -back seasons of winning, which has never been done before. And since the 70s, the Steelers have won two more Super Bowl titles in 2006 and 2009, so they're still good. I, mean, I don't know how long it's been since the Bears have won a Super Bowl, but what do you think, Robert? Well, the Bears, ever since day one, have had the best defense in the NFL. They have always been a force to reckon with, for sure. Uh, 1985 was their only Super Bowl season, uh, but... In 2006, they went back to the Super Bowl, losing to the Colts. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so we got team on, we got the ownerships, and the excellent team All right, what else you guys got? I'd like to talk about the Hall of Fame. Pittsburgh currently has 19 Hall of Fame players, including Terry Bradshaw and Mingo Green, who led them to those four Super Bowl titles in the 70s. And I'm sure they have more to come because, I mean, they're still doing amazing. This ranks them third overall in Hall of Famers. That's pretty much third. It is, but Garrett, you should not have brought up the Hall of Fame because the Bears <laughs> have 26 members, ranking them first in the NFL. They, uh, people like Walter Payton, one of the, the best running back ever. Uh, also, they have the most retired numbers in the NFL, 13 of them. You kind of got you that. Yeah, but he's forgetting the most interesting point of all, and that's the fans. I mean, what makes the team? The fans. ESPN ranked the Steelers fan base number one in the nation, which I don't know where the Bears rank on that, but Pittsburgh has 299 consecutive sold-out games and counting, which is unheard of. That's by far the biggest record. What do you think? Okay. 
Uh, the Bears have the best fans in the NFL because mostly SNL's Bill Gorski super fan sketch. What did what did ESPN rank the Bears? Fans? Well, ESPN ranked them 13th. Oh, but <laughs> it's irrelevant because <laughs> fans are the best. Also, the Super Bowl shuffle recorded by the 1985 Super Bowl team makes them very popular. And they are the Bears. The Bears. <laughs> So, you're saying the Steelers are the best because they've got the family-owned uh, team and they've got a great record for when they've been around. Mm -hmm. Old school, yes. And you're saying the Bears are better because they've got the lowest team, second lowest team in the league? Second lowest team in the league. Founded by the A Steelers company. And they have, compared to the Steelers, The win ratio is better That's true. than the Steelers. All right, so, and you're also saying the Steelers are better because they have 19 Hall of Fame, which compared to his 26 really doesn't compare. <laughs> but they have been around longer. They have been around longer. And the Steeler Nation is ranked number one compared to the Bears, who are ranked 13. That's true. But that's all right. <laughs> okay, so let's look at some overall stats. Um, last playoff appearance for the Steelers was 2008. 2006. And uh, you see up there, overall, I go back and forth, except for the Super Bowl appearances and wins. Which so, is the only thing you know, that. Ball of Fame kind of got kind of you with that, though. Yeah. So I guess the real question is what do you guys think? Who's the better team? Bears, Bears. Bears. Tell Bears. Let's take a class vote. <laughs> class vote. Who's, who's your pick? Steelers. Uh, yeah! <laughs> Alright, who fixed the bears? Stop bears. Uh, there's, 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 there's,